hey time signs that a man loves you the most important thing before we start this video is to know that you are worthy value yourself put value in yourself and stop making men play with you like a like a ball or like a tomato when we we're growing up they used to come and tell us that um don't allow these guys to make you a tomato do you know what they do to a tomato at the market everyone comes and touching like no not this one they choose touching touching no you understand me so all i'm saying is be a woman of high value be a woman of value love yourself before you love other people if you see that some of the points here i've seen them even in my husband i met my husband in november 2012 2013 2013 then he, we got married in july so it's seven months eight months later and here are some signs that showed that he showed that no this guy is truthful okay. he gives one. you time no matter how, how much busy he is okay so my husband is um my boyfriend then okay so let's just say my boyfriend my boyfriend then he was like a workaholic or he had a very demanding job he would knock off at 3 a.m sometimes he would he was like very very busy but he would make sure that he would make time sometime to me to see me you understand me so he would make time to see me if he can't see me he would call like he would, he would call maybe three four five times a day like he would call and say hi i just want to know if you're okay so basically all i'm saying is he gives you time even if he doesn't have time number He's two loyal and faithful <sighs> you guys do you know that there are people who are very loyal people who are faithful is in love with you is going to be loyal and faithful to you um i i I know it's not easy to to measure loyalty but i'm sure you can see that this person is very loyal you can see if somebody's dodgy um let me give you an example my like these days it's very easy to see if somebody is cheating or not if he's loyal or not you can see like my my boyfriend then he didn't have any problem to answer he would give you would be like yeah answer my phone or check who sent a text you know something like that he's loyal he's got nothing to hide i think that's the proper word he Number checks on you all the times he calls you want to know what are you doing where are you what's happening you know you know somebody who gives attention to something that he loves you understand me just like you when you buy your new car you love your car you want to see where's the car is it outside so i remember the first time i had a car would go outside and chip chip and make sure that it's locked you know all those things he checks on you all the times because he wants to see if you're okay he's supportive um, he supports you whatever you want to do he's not there to discourage you i've seen people who look down upon their girlfriends like ah you can't do this you know he's supportive whatever you want to do he supports he's encouraging he's a he's your number one supporter you know saying whatever you're doing whether you're doing driving lessons whether you it's work whether it's a presentation at work he supports you he encourages you he gives and he won't demand anything in return i think we have we, we have seen people who are here to play people who want to do butter trade they give you something in return of something they want something back you know you don't just get things for free from the other guys the other guys who are here to play but when i met my boyfriend then who's now my husband um i think a month into our relationship he, he brought me a samsung s4 you guys like s4 and i think the year is 2012 2013 it was like the biggest thing you know just like your, your iphone 14 i was so excited it was like the latest phone i was so excited he just came and say tech a new one you guys he care he just gave just giving you know without expecting anything in return and you can realize that this guy is truly in love beauty. with me okay, okay he sees your beauty even if when you're wearing <laughs> He sees your beauty even if you're not wearing your wig. Like, <laughs> okay, you guys, this one makes me laugh. It's he sees your beauty even if you're just, you're just yourself. You're just waking up. He don't see the bad thing in you. He don't see. He sees nothing. He sees perfection. All he sees is perfection. You know, sometimes when we are not wearing our wigs, we look funny. We look different. And but he sees beauty he sees smile he sees something nice on you he's like oh i love your smile i got a beautiful smile it's your smile he loves everything he sees good things in you he chooses to see good things in you whenever he's around you whether you've got makeup on or we don't have makeup on all i'm saying is there are days when you, you have bad hair days there are days when you're not looking your best but he still chooses to see the good in you there are people like that people you guys there are people like that you understand me there are people like that 
right. you feel um, it feels good when you achieve in life like when you have an achievement he doesn't see you as a competitor he sees he says he feels good about you. He's so proud of about you. He's like, girl, girl, I'm so proud. He doesn't see you as a competitor. I know of a lot of people. A friend of mine once told me that she did some program, like a short course. Then her boyfriend also was like, no, let me just do the short, short course. It's like we're competing. No, 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 no. We're not competing. We complement each other, okay? If you ever see your guy being competitive with you, then no, no no he's not in love with you okay the um, next point is he's respectful even if he's stressed if you squeeze an orange there's this beautiful smell scent fruity smell that comes out so where is it coming from it's coming from this pressure so there are people that even if they are under pressure you don't see the bad but you still see the goodness in them the people you care about he cares about yeah my husband he knows that I care so much about my family. So whenever there's something that's happening in the family, he does the stuff, he contributes. Or let's just say, um, he does things for my family without even me knowing. You understand me? He knows that I care for this one. He knows that I care for my mom. I care for my sister. I care for my brother. Whenever they are struggling, maybe sometimes they even talk on their own and he helps without even me knowing, you guys. Uh, that, that part really humbles me. He forgives. He forgives and gives you a second chance. So, once upon a time, I was dating this guy. Then... Um, the, the guy the guy I'm talking about is my husband so you know yeah so I was dating this guy then this ex-boyfriend of mine comes and he tells he told my husband a lot of things lies what what everything then my, my, my boyfriend then came in like I heard about this and that but we want to go and verify so we went and verified you know because he wanted he, he wanted he wanted everything up to do with me he forgive he forgave me he said let's go and see this guy we drove to this guy's place it was awkward then we verified of course there are some things that are true and some more, most of the things were not true and he forgave me <laughs> like you guys i don't know what you want what else do you want what do you want <laughs> Okay, so I hope you're going to resonate with me. I hope this video makes sense to somebody. No, be a woman who knows what he wants.